Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. We are here on our way to Fremont, California to try to find something called the Secret Sidewalk. So hidden away in the Nile Canyon is a two mile long concrete aqueduct that used to provide fresh and clean water to the county of Alameda. Okay, so the catch is is that I heard that it's actually quite difficult to find as well as a bit difficult to climb to as well as onto the aqueduct. So hopefully, I'm hoping that we will be able to do it. We are not the most athletic of sorts. <laughs> so I am hoping that we'll be able to find this place and explore it, but we'll definitely do our best. So we made it to our starting point that starts right at a train track crossing. The online directions did tell us to just follow the tracks. So follow the tracks we do. So we found a nice little trail right beside the railroad tracks. And since the railroad tracks is still active, I feel like this is just the safer route to go, but this is one of the entrances that you can take to get to the secret sidewalk. I know that there are quite a few other entry points. From all the research that I've done, I feel like this is the easiest one without having to do all sorts of acrobatics and like hardcore climbing. So perfect for us. The secret sidewalk is actually not a sidewalk. It is the top of an old cement aqueduct built around the 1920s to bring fresh water to the city, but was shut down just three years after opening, so it sits. Looky guys, we found the sidewalk. Look how high up it is. You have to climb that. <laughs> Wish us luck. A few moments later, so we decided that this is the spot we're going to climb up to. It looks doable compared to what was over there. So yeah. A few moments later. No, we'll climb okay guys, I made it. But look how high this wall is. And this is the moment where I touched poison oak, which I did end up getting a rash about two weeks later. I'm not that strong where I can lift myself up. Just letting you know. And there seems to be poison oak everywhere too. I think I just touched that. Yes, yes, you did. Past Alice. But, yeah. We're making it. Come on, Karen. Test the branches first. Yeah, yeah. Good job. You got this. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. I need a break. There's poison oak up here, just FYI. Where? Right there. Right there. My shoulder just bumped one at first. So yeah. Sidewalk. And now that we are officially on the secret sidewalk, it finally felt real. It was so cool and we were the only ones there making the area feel that much more isolated. But we were not the only ones that were drawn to this secluded forbidden spot. In the 1970s, this sidewalk became a haven for teenagers. It was secluded, covered, with no roads to get to it. So, teens found this place to be the best spot to hang out away from the praying eyes of adults. All right, fun fact regarding this secret sidewalk. Now, if you guys don't know who Charlie Chaplin is, he is like this old Hollywood actor that did those um, silent black and white films. He was considered funny at that time. I don't know if that humor is relatable now, but he was the man back in the day. And yeah, 
some of his first films was filmed on this secret sidewalk. Here is the famous bridge that everyone looks for when they're here. It's just a very beautiful bridge as you can see covered in graffiti and down below is actually really nice and graffitied up as well. So from this entrance down here, if you can look, there's ropes. So we found our way down, thank goodness. <laughs> All right, you guys, so we found one of the entrances into the aqueduct and someone was nice enough to build a ladder, so that is so great. I brought my flashlight, so let's explore it just a little bit. <laughs> I'm really curious to see what's inside. Going in. I actually don't like going backwards on a, on a ladder either. <laughs> So I don't know if anyone wants to join me, but it kind of smells down here, you guys. And I'm too scared to do it by myself. Does anyone want to come down with me? Anyone? Any takers? It's kind of scary down here. I don't want to do it alone. Yeah, come back up. <laughs> uh, I guess no one wants to do it with me. Speaking of spooky, there is a haunted legend associated to the sidewalk as well as the narrow winding road nearby known as the White Witch of Niles Canyon. There are many versions to this story. Some call the ghost the White Witch, while others call her the Nile Canyon Ghost. Was she celebrating her prom the night of her death? Or was it her wedding night? Was it in the 1920s or the 1940s? One thing for certain is she appears every February 26th in a dirty white dress, and many believe she is the cause of countless car accidents that happen in the canyon. So the question is, do you dare to come here on a February 26th night? Look at you guys, we are out of the woods and into open space. Check it out. So right now we are actually on top of the train tunnel and we realize there is another entrance up here and there's also a rope to help you climb up. So that is another entry point. And I think we're gonna take this one versus the one all the way over there because this seems a lot easier. Alright guys, so this is the end of the aqueduct, so we made it, yay! Alright guys, so now not so fun fact. So in 2018, the city decided that this aqueduct area was a little too dangerous for people to explore. So they did come to a, the decision to tear this down. So as you can see from right here, they did start tearing things down. I believe it's supposed to connect somewhere. There's like another pipe area just right there. So they did, it seems like they started tearing it down. But from what you have seen us explore, a lot of it is still here, which is great. Okay guys, so the climb down was so easy. I wish 
we actually came all the way down to the tunnel first because there are ropes and a fence to help you climb up. Look at that. Right, Neb? Hmm? It's easy, right? A lot yeah, easier? Very easy. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, very he's being easy. sarcastic. Yeah. Sarcastic. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, I thought it was easy. It was a lot more enjoyable. I didn't feel like I was going to die like I did when I was climbing up <laughs> using roots and rocks for footing. Lesson of the day get to the tunnel and climb up from there and then you'll be at one end, just walk to the other end and then come back because this is definitely, definitely the easier path. All right guys, so we're back on the railroad tracks and we're heading back and I think it's fair, oh, of course the wind. I need something fair. Of course the wind. Let's wait until the wind dies down first. All right guys, I'm gonna be really, really quick but we are back on the railroad tracks and it was such a good day today. I think it took us maybe just an hour and a half to do this entire thing. And I think I hear the train coming. So I'm just gonna say goodbye. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video today. And if you did like it, don't forget to give me a thumbs up. And if you haven't subscribed, don't, he don't hesitate to, oh my gosh, I'm getting nervous. <laughs> the train is getting closer. But if you haven't subscribed yet, don't hesitate to hit that subscribe button to see future videos of mine and I'll talk to you guys later. Happy wandering, everybody. Thank you guys so much.